Okay, in this clip, we're going to create a looping bass track using the same auto create track that we used in, with the drums. It's going to be done a little bit differently because we're not recording multiple instruments. We want to record different takes basically. Let's go where there's an empty track and you can just double click. It'll bring up a new track. And then we're going to choose audio instrument 2. And for this one, we're going to choose the ES2. Now the ES2 has lots of good bass sounds in here. We're going to choose the punchy R&B bass. A good sounding bass. Now if it's record enabled, you should be able to hear it. Now what we're going to do to set up this uh, auto create track is with the mute on it. So you want to go to your record settings and make sure that auto mute and cycle record is selected along with auto create tracks and cycle record. We'll close that window. So now what's going to happen when I hit the record button every time it loops through It'll create a new track, but it'll mute the first one that we did. So this way you can hear only your new track that you're recording.